Now we are going to do the actual software and driver configuration for NVIDIA Surround and 3D Vision Surround. And here we've brought up the NVIDIA control panel. And there is a new section here called Configure SLI, PhysX, and Surround. It's kind of like a catch-all for all their features that they now have on their, on their graphics cards. As you can see here, we just set the following, and you have SLI configuration options of maximize 3D performance, span displays with surround, activate all displays, or disable SLI. So you've got uh, a lot of different options here. So we want to span displays with surround. And this is actually going to create one giant screen resolution for games to interpret and everything else to interpret as well. So we'll highlight that and then click on configure here and we see that it has all three displays selected. They're all check marks, meaning that they are capable of, of running this. So we'll hit apply on that and uh, all of our screens blank out. We get a little bit of our window noise and eventually we will be brought back to this uh, control panel here is I will uh, move it back into our scene here. And here's where we need to set up which uh, which monitors are in which location here. So if we hit identify, you'll see all the, mod all the monitors show up. And as it happens, you can see here, we could move these around if we wanted to. As we hit identify, we'll see one is in front of us, three to the left, two to the right. And we can make sure that that is exactly as they show up on the image in the control panel, click apply there. And now it's going to ask us if we want to do bezel correction, which uh, will help remove image gaps from your bezels here. So you can see it does something interesting uh, here. It uses a roadway with straight lines to uh, help identify that. And so all it's doing here is it's asking you to select the number of pixels necessary to make it look like a straight line. Now here, you could do things like hold up a pad of paper or uh, anything really to try to, to, to make yourself get as straight a line as possible. And uh, this will obviously, you need to have your monitors set up uh, kind of as perfectly as you can in terms of where they're gonna be finally placed so you can get uh, the best Best results here. So it creates a resolution. We'll then uh, finalize everything. And you'll see here we have one solid display going across everything. And uh, that pretty much sets everything up. You can adjust your PhysX settings. Since you are running an SLI configuration with NVIDIA Surround, you can choose which GPU gets it or if you want to force it onto the CPU. Um, you can set up, set up stereoscopic 3D. This is obviously for 3D vision surround. If you have that enabled, you can go through that whole setup process, which is identical to the previous 3D vision setup process. Uh, but now, obviously, it will span three displays. And one last thing is if we go into Windows properties here, you'll see we have our new resolution of 5760 by 1080 available. But we also have another rev resolution here at the top titled 5932 by 1080. And that uh, takes into account the bezel correction for between the three displays. So you can switch to that when you want to enable bezel correction or you switch back when you do not want it. And it's just that simple.